Hello everyone, this is Hoda Ganji. In the last video we created the walls and floors. In this video I'm going to work on this uh, staircase which has double flight. So it's double flight staircase. Uh, so I'm going to start here. Uh, you can uh, hide the floor or something uh, if it helps. And uh, uh, let's see, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then the landing here seven risers then the landing and one two three four five six seven eight on this side right so it's 16 overall and i know that my uh, height is 2.8 so if i go with 2.8 divided by 16 it's going to be 0 0.175 window um, model info make sure that your units has three decimal places so we can go with 0 0.175 uh, so here how about i just draw one line uh, first here so I'm gonna go with L uh, this line is gonna be vertical so you just move up along the blue axis or hit the top arrow key and then I want to type 0 0.175 so this is the height of one riser and then I want to draw one more line align the um, green axis and it's going to be uh, as long as the step size so it's going to step uh, it's going to finish here uh, this is what all what we need for the stairs and it's going to be one two three four five six and seven of them before the landing how about i just uh, hide other stuff that we don't need i'm just going to hide them and remove the hidden objects we just need these two i want to make a component out of the riser and the step when you make a component, let's uh, name it a step, uh, when you make changes to the step, it's going to change uh, actually uh, the rest of the components. That's why I made a component, not a group. I'm going to double click here, draw some lines, maybe it's going to be um, 0 0.02 for the thickness. I'm going to click here, I'm going to go with 0 0.02 here and click here that looks good so this is my set of uh, stairs you can copy it right now or later uh, so let me copy it right now I want to go with move hit control once from this corner to this corner it's copied once now if you type X 6 because overall it has to be 7 if I go with x6 it's gonna copy that 6 times plus the first one is gonna add up to 7 right 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 now I want to hit a space double click here uh, and whatever you change here as I mentioned for instance if you move this line back there it's gonna change in the other ones too because this is a component double click I want to go with P I know that um, you can measure this, but I know that this is 0 0.95 in my plan, so I want to go with 0 0.95. You need to measure this on your plan, and let me hit a space. I want to select one of these, and I actually want to maybe make a group. And in the material, I can assign a wood material to this part, so let's go with wood. Uh, this wood hit a space uh, P here and I want to also push this by 0.95 you can assign other material or you can leave it you can make a group out of the riser as well uh, it seems good to me I want to make a group out of this part so make a group so uh, this is our first set of flights uh, feel free to hide other stuff I want to hide other things here, unhide them, excuse me, and then we have the plan here, uh, how about I also hide the walls, I don't need them, I can hide also the floor, I just want to keep my uh, plan, I want to go with hidden objects here, I just want to have the plan, right, so now I know if I uh, have the landing, and then if I move it up, uh, it's going to be over there. So uh, how about I go with L for the landing. I'm going to draw one landing around here. 
and for this landing uh, how about I make a group first I want to make a group out of it double click now I want to move this up first so I'm going to go with P by 0 0.02 centimeters so it's going to be the same material the top of it uh, with the uh, steps that we have over there and let me double click here so I want to make a group out of this part so let's make a group this is going to be the wood part and I want to draw the lines again so L I want to follow the corners so this time I want to create the rest of the landing right below the wooden part here I want to go with P and if this is 0.175 minus 0 0.02 uh, is the height is going to be 0.155 so we're going to have the same height for the landing as we have for uh, the risers okay uh, now I want to double click here double click here this group at the top I, I can assign wood to that uh, hit a space the rest of it is good now this whole thing looks good so how about I uh, move this up uh, so this edge needs to go to that edge I want to go with uh, move or M and from this corner we're going to move up uh, you can also hit the top arrow key so make sure that it goes up and we're going to uh, finish it right here so this seems correct uh, let me unhide maybe the wall just to make sure so I'm gonna go with view hidden objects unhide the wall there we go now it's exactly where it needs to be uh, and here on this side how about I go to my components let's see what we have we have one step here um, I can also make a component out of the group but for now let's just go with this step I'm going to put it somewhere around here and then we just need to mirror it so uh, that's now over there I need to rotate it and mirror it so how about I go with R actually Q for rotate and uh, we're going to rotate it by 180 degrees I want to type 180 we also want to move it so hit a space select it M and this corner needs to go to this corner so this should be okay right now the size and everything seems right how about I copy this and uh, if it's not correct I will adjust it so I want to select this go with M control from actually this corner goes to this corner and then I also want to type X uh, we had 8 here so I guess I should go with X7 if there is one extra I can erase it later and now to make sure that everything is good and correct I want to move uh, my floor here over there for now so how about I select this uh, go with move and from that corner it needs to go to this corner here yeah I have one extra stair I can get rid of it but the rest of them look uh, pretty good we can also change the material over there later but uh, everything here seems good so I want to select the uh, stairs here actually I want to make a group out of this as well now out of the three items here the two flights hold shift and the landing the three of them I also want to make another group so I can move them easier if need be later uh, feel free to unhide other stuff here everything looks good uh, we can keep working if um, you are not comfortable working like this you can move the floor back over there we can move this from this edge all the way to that but image let me get it like this right so basically it's let me hit a space it's kind of like it goes down which is correct usually the top of the floor matches with the level so this is now good uh, maybe it's better to keep them separate because 
uh, now if you want to create the doors the windows and everything uh, it's going to be easier and at the very end we can just assemble the two together uh, in the past videos we have talked about how to create the roof the doors and the windows so i'm gonna leave that up to you